Right now, Georgia lawmakers are meeting, trying to learn how they can tackle a really big problem across our state, and that's just trying to keep teachers on the job. Atlanta News First Asia Wilson is joining us now live from the Georgia State Capitol as two Senate committees are having a joint meeting right now. And Asia, what, what's this all about? Well, essentially, this is more of a fact-finding meeting where lawmakers are looking at ways to enhance recruitment and retention efforts statewide. Now, the Senate committees on education and youth and higher education are in this joint meeting. Lawmakers are looking at a current da data on educator workforce. They're hearing from governor's office and different groups within the education community about the issue. Some teachers are also testifying, giving their viewpoints on retention and recruitment, but they're also looking at where districts and colleges of education are showing success with sustaining a strong educator pipeline. Now, Senator Clint Dixon, who represents portions of Gwinnett and Barrow counties, says while Georgia has the highest teacher pay in the southeast, Teacher retention and teacher recruitment is what they are trying to improve. Always trying to do better, but wanting to figure out uh, the issues, you know, especially coming from COVID, uh, dealing with teacher retention, uh, you know, especially in rural Georgia and South Georgia, kind of what those issues are. And then also recruitment, you know, how can we, uh, you know, what are the things that we need to do better in the education world to recruit young uh, folks coming out of college to recruit them into being teachers as well. Now, Senator Dixon says that they will likely have three to four meetings throughout the fall. And depending on what they find, uh, some legislation could come out of all of this sometime next year. We're live in downtown Atlanta. Asia Wilson, Atlanta News First.